This video will show you how to make an aesthetic or pretty notes document in Google Docs. So we'll start off with basic text and we put in the basic formatting. So we put in H1 here. This is a H2. And this is a H3. And this is our basic notes text in bullets. Now we'll style our headings. So our H1, we'll give the color. We're going to use the yellow here. I am using the Color Hunt website at colorhunt.co to get nice color palettes. I will leave a link to the website in the description below. I already have it as a custom color, yellow. And I'm going to change the font to Oswald. And I'm going to then move down to the H2. I'm going to move, change the font to Consolas. And then I'm going to change the background to Format, Borders and Shading. And then we'll add a color. And we'll use the purple, it's a custom color from my palette. Click apply. Now notice how high that, color, that row is. So we're going to reduce the height of that. Click on it again. Go to format, borders and shading. And in this place, put padding of one. And that reduces the height of the row. And then we change that color to white to make it nice and visible. And then the H3. We'll turn it to Oswald. And then we put some highlighting behind it. And we'll use the pink color. We'll go to our, we'll go to our palette. And we'll turn the text white. For more visibility. And now we go to our bullet points. Change the font to Consolas. And we'll reduce the line height to single. And now I'll just reduce the lecture, the lecture date size to nine and change the color to yellow. We make it bold. At this point, I'll change the background of the page. Go to page setup, change the color to a light yellow, and then change all the margins to give your notes more space. We'll also change the notes text color to the red in our palette. Click here to copy the code. Add custom code. And there's the red. And now we'll add our header block. So insert drawing, new drawing. Then go to shapes. And we'll use this shape. Choose any shape you think suits the header of your document. And now we'll add a color from our palette. This one here. Fill it in. Use the custom. Then make a copy. And then change the color of this one. Use another custom color. This one here. Add the custom color. Move 
move it up a bit and save. Now we can bring that to the front. We want to put it in front of or behind text. And then we also want to fix position on page. That enables us to move it up here. And then these two pieces of text, we're going to center justify. Move the block a bit further and bring it up above. And there's the heading for our lecture notes. We can reduce the size between these two by going single. Now that we're happy with our formatting, we'll apply the new styles to the document. So heading one, update heading one to match, up to heading two, click on heading two, update heading two to match, click on heading three, update heading three to match. Whoops. Update heading three to match. So now we can go to the other H3 headings. Change the default formatting for the body text as well. And now put bullet points in. Use the one we're used to. And now we can highlight certain notes. Add to highlight. So that's your aesthetic notes document. In the description, I'll put a link to this template which you can use for your own purposes if you wish. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to support the channel. Thank you.